Hi, this is Ashley Caps with Trap Online. When you set out to learn more about cloud computing, I bet you didn't think that you were going to learn an entirely new language along with it. This week's Whiteboard Wednesday will help you decode the cloud. Let's start with software as a service. For example, Gmail. When you log into your Gmail account, you're not hosting your own email server. Google hosts it for you and you're accessing it via your browser as a client. Software as a service is really geared toward the end users in your organization and doesn't take much to get started. The hosting provider figures out how many resources to devote to your use of the application. Additionally, the provider figures out the servers, the virtual machines, the network equipment, and beyond. You just type in your unique portal URL and you're done. Infrastructure as a service is where things begin to change. With this setup, you maintain control of your software environment, but you don't maintain any equipment. You don't have to buy servers and put them in a climate-controlled room or any of that. Instead, you go to an infrastructure-as-a-service provider and request a virtual machine. Then, you're free to put whatever software you want on your virtual machine. On the back end, the provider gets you storage or other resources as you need them. Platform as a Service is a happy medium between software as a service and infrastructure as a service. It doesn't wrap everything up into a neat package like software as a service, and you're not free to go tinkering with servers like with infrastructure as a service. Platform as a Service gives your application developers hooks and tools to develop that particular platform. Thanks for watching this week's Whiteboard Wednesday. Be sure to check back next week for a new video.